this is the first time I'm ever driving an NA Miata. I'm just making it. Oh wow. Thanks so much, by the way. Hey everyone, it is a Sunday today, a little bit past 10. And today I want to take a bunch of pictures of cars because uh, yeah, this is the usual cars in Coffee Street. It's a little bit um it's a little bit slow today, a little bit of a lazy Sunday, but I like this overcast weather, really even lighting. I'm with my cousin Wakin. Hi. He's gonna be he's gonna be following me along while we take some pictures and yeah, let's go see what comes up here. Let's go see what kind of cool cars we can take pictures of and what kind of angles we can get. We're gonna come back here in the afternoon for the afternoon run. Um, some of my friends are gonna come here too. And let's see what we can get. So for the first shot, I want to get like a thir three quarters shot right here at this angle. And then I'm going to go for one on the side and one in the rear. Let's see if I can get one right now at this angle, at this height, and then a one really low one. Uh, I'm pretty excited to see how it turns out. Let's go. Then let's move on to the side. Ooh. This is pretty nice. And then let's go take one from the rear. So I'm thinking right now I can try to use these poles for some depth of field and then take the car behind it. Let's see how it turns out. Oh my God, this is really cool. I didn't know this. But actually, the red Miata is like was one of my one of my friends' Miata. Dude, how often do you drive this man? You love it versus the Cayman? <laughs> um, the Cayman's different. Where the Miata is like balanced as well as the Cayman. Oh. But the Miata, the the, the manual shifters, it's, it, it's different. <laughs> I Dude, I love it, man. This thing is absolutely. A, I see. I want. I, I want to use the word adorable because I just love the compactness of it, and I. Well, I've never driven one. I heard the driving experience is very, very nice. <laughs> you can drive it now if you want to. Oh my gosh, dude. The last manual car I actually drove was a manual uh, Vios. Vios? <laughs> Vios, yeah. The Vios. Toyota. And that thing's bite point was crazy. <laughs> this bite point is it's adjusted quite high, so it's kind of get some getting used to. But well, it's easy. Miatas are easy to drive. Dude, I'd love to try it out, if, if, it's, if that's okay. Yeah, sure. Oh dang! Yeah. This, is, this is the first time I'm ever driving an NA Miata. I'm just making it. Oh wow. Dude, it, it, this feels really cool. Driving a automatic car is just so... I don't even think. <laughs> I'm actually super happy right now. I'm not sure if you could tell. Because I never sat in an NA Miata before in my life. Dude, this is great. Thanks so much, by the way. Wow. Oh yeah, and before I forget, I haven't taken any handheld B-roll of the car, so uh... Let's get those letter boxes down here if I want to use them and let's uh, get some B-roll. Love your car, man. It's clean, it's clean. Is it, can you tell me a little bit about your car, man? How long have you been driving it? You know, like, how is it, man? How's the driving experience? Uh, well, my, it's actually my dad's car. I just borrowed it occasionally. It's good taste. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, we got this brand new mm -hmm. back in 2014. Wow. Uh, right now, it has 15,000 kilometers. Ooh. So it's kind of low. That's good. That's like a weekend, kind of weekend yeah, fun car. Yeah, kind of weekend car. Nice. Um, not that much much besides the wheels, oh. uh, which are Rotas. Uh, Philippine made, let's go. Philippine made? Philippine made. What do you call it again, the wheel brand? Uh, Rota, Rota. Rota, I'm going to check it out. Yeah, sure, dude. And uh, yeah, I'm going to take some photos, check it out. So, ran into a little bit of a problem. I want to get a side shot, but yeah, it seems a little bit tight. I, I, could, I don't want to go too wide on the lens because it'll make the car look weird. So this car is a little bit in the way. Let's see if I can get something in between the stand and the car. Uh, I'm not sure how it'll turn out, but you know, you just got to take all the shots you can get. So right now this car is in the shot for a rear shot. I'd have to fix my angles a little bit to not get it in the way. And uh, let's see how it turns out. All right, so it was a little bit slow today, but I met some incredible people, got to drive an NA Miata, which was so sick. I'm so happy, my smile's still on my face. <laughs> um, we're gonna go and have some lunch and we'll come back in the afternoon. Let's go ahead to the boys, let's see what cars are here. And uh, yeah, stay tuned. Well, I'll just teleport right there right now. So. 
We're back here in Yardstick. There was a flash rain, which means everyone pretty much left. And uh, so people are starting to slowly come back. A few of my friends are here, and there doesn't seem to be any cool cars to take pictures of, but some of my friends have motorcycles, and we're gonna take pictures of those. I think you can see it right behind this car, which got in the way. Right there, those guys over there. And uh, yeah, I haven't really taken pictures of motorcycles before, so we can get some detailed shots. I just can see if I can try to get some wide shots with people in the way, but uh, yeah, gotta make do what you have, with what you have and uh, let's have some fun. So just from looking at the composition, there's that guy standing in the background. I'm gonna kindly ask him if he can move. Otherwise, I think it's pretty nice that the background's kind of plain. I'll see if I can get a few group shots with the bikes and then some detail shots of some of the nicer features. And yeah, let's see what I can get. Enjoy. Anyways, if you guys are here right now watching this part of the video, thank you so much for sticking around. I actually wasn't really planning on like doing anything really, just enjoying the scenery, chilling with some friends. I wasn't planning on shooting video at all, but I thought it will be really interesting and fun to just like record whatever and just do whatever. I got to drive an NA Miata for the very first time and even sit in one, which was really cool. Thanks, Evan. And uh, I took some photos. I hope you guys like it. You know, it was kind of weird with the filter you know, coming on and off, and I took some photos with the ND filter on, but I don't know. I'm gonna edit it later, see how it turns out. You guys probably saw it already if you're watching at this point, and I hope you guys enjoyed it. This was just pretty candid, pretty chill, and yeah, thanks for sticking around. I'll see you. Bye-bye.